A 35-year-old woman was evaluated for her pulmonary valve stenosis. At which of the following locations would the affected valve auscultate it? Before answering this question, it should be clear that all the valves of the heart are grouped behind the sternum. This is the anatomical location. However, the anatomical location is not of clinical interest. The sounds produced by these valves are best heard on the chest wall at sites other than their anatomical relation. And this is what we are being asked about in this question. Where would the affected valve be auscultated? Again, I repeat that when these valves are listened to at their anatomical locations, it's not possible to distinguish clearly the sounds produced at individual valves. Usually, the valve sounds or the auscultatory areas are wide apart and they differ, as I said, from the surface projection of the heart valves, from the anatomical, actual anatomical relations of the heart valves. Because blood tends to carry the sound in the direction of its flow, then each area is situated superficial to the chamber or the vessel through which the blood has passed. Now let's look at the options. Right second intercostal space actually is the area of the aortic valve and this would be the direction of blood flow in the ascending aorta. Second option, right fifth intercostal space, there is no such valve that can be auscultated in the right fifth intercostal space. The left second intercostal space to the side of the sternum is actually the site of auscultation of the pulmonary valve and this as we can see here this is the direction of blood flow in the pulmonary trunk. Option D left fifth intercostal space the left fifth intercostal space although it is not mentioned here in the option but left fifth intercostal space in the midclavicular line is the site of auscultation of the mitral valve and this represents the direction of blood flow through the mitral valve from the left atrium to the left ventricle. Left lower sternal body border. Actually, at the lower border of the sternum, it is the tricuspid valve that can be auscultated. Here is the direction of blood flow and the tricuspid valve from the right atrium to the right ventricle. So the correct option here, the auscultatory area of the pulmonary valve, is the left second intercostal space just to the left of the sternum.